was growing up, I heard all about the Boys and Girls Club because it was founded in 1952 specifically by my grandfather and a gentleman named Eddie Skurlock. Started out just as the Variety Boys Club. I got involved because I wanted to continue the legacy that my grandfather had established here in Houston and my dad as well. I thought I want to give back and I want to continue this loving legacy that he created for the community. From 1972 to three years ago, I find myself going to 1520 Airline, being a product of working at Boys and Girls Club. So that was my life for 34 years. Our former president, John Havard of Boys and Girls Club in 1982 took a chance on me. So not only did he make an impact, he made a difference in my life of Boys and Girls Club. He took me in as a mentor, and he took me in, and he entrusted me as being a leader within the Boys and Girls Club organization. What I love the most about Boys and Girls Club is it is about building good people. Not just good athletes, not just good students, but good people. And the fact that every child who participates in Boys and Girls Club has access to programming that makes them very well-rounded, that's probably what I get the most joy of. Boys and Girls Club of Greater Houston helps fulfill, you know, a huge need with our families. A lot of our families are working class families. You know, they are coming either, they are single, single parent households or having to work multiple jobs. And so they rely on us to have their children there for the whole day. Without us, they would have nowhere to send their children. My favorite thing about working with the Boys and Girls Club is definitely the environment, the fun environment. From coming in and communicating with my coworkers and talking with them and then also engaging with the youth whenever we have events. The Boys and Girls Club prepares the next generation to be leaders. I'm hoping that I have impacted a lot of the club members, um, and I know that I have run into some club members and have told me it is heartfelt to hear those stories from them, but then a lot too that, that I do think about and wonder, hey, I wonder where they're at, and hoping um, that they're doing well. It wasn't for Boys and Girls Club, I honestly don't know where my kids would be going after school. The club fills a very big gap for you and your child to have this, this sense of security when you, when you need someone to be there for your children. Boys and Girls Club of Greater Houston provides an affordable yet safe place for our members to go to after school. There's a lot of stuff at the Boys and Girls Club. It's really fun. There's pool, there's video games, there's sheet stuff, coloring, you can read. There's a lot of stuff to do. Miss Diamond helps me with my homework with like uh, like fractions, uh, multiplication and area, perimeters, um, yeah, she helps me a lot. Working here is really going to be a difference in me so that I can be better for my kids and then show them how excited I am about my job. When I come to Boys and Girls Club, I feel more calmer and relaxed than I ever was in school, home, or anywhere else. I can be myself. They have these little coding blocks and it's just basic coding, but for kids, and um, by that I'm learning a little bit, a little bit uh, by uh, like coding in real life. I only know one script so far, a script to make uh, something block. But I usually know uh, I can do it way faster with Scratch. I also made a game with it. It's fully functional. It just needs a loading screen and just needs an ending screen. One of the other things that Boys and Girls Club has done is to think about what the future needs are. This year, in 2022, we decided that we needed a DEI committee at a board level. And uh, what we will do as a DEI committee, as a board uh, committee, is to support our employees and to make sure that our employees have the programming they need to take care of the families. I just want to say from my grandfather, George Strait Sr., my dad, George Strait Jr., who is still alive today and loving the clubs, that I am wishing the Boys and Girls Club a very happy 70th anniversary from my entire family. Happy anniversary to the Boys and Girls Club. 70 years in the community of Houston is extraordinary, especially when you think of how much the city of Houston has grown. And so we need your help. We need your help because this organization is critical to the next generation of Houstonians. It's critical to our underserved communities. 
It's so critical to drive opportunity for such a diverse city. And I always would tell my children, be as big as you can be. Go beyond, be greater, be bigger, be better. Just keep going, change the world. There's no limit to what you can do. When I grow up, I want to be an architect and interior designer. I want to be a software engineer. I want to be a teacher. I want to be a soldier. I want to be a cosmetologist. I want to be a firefighter. I want to be a singer. I want to be a boxer. I want to be a cop. I want to be a surgeon. I want to be a teacher. So happy birthday to Boys and Girls Club and please support us. We need you for the next 70 years. <laughs>